the upper Yukon River, near the Arctic Circle, in the vast expanse of the Alaskan wild. There is a light, a beacon of hope. And the reason we built a camp in the middle of nowhere is because there's a lot of wonderful people who happen to live in the middle of nowhere. And they just need some real positive input. They need someone who believes in it. In spite of tremendous odds, danger, and cost, they are united by a cause to build a place of healing for native youth in the middle of the harsh climate of this wild country. To make this work is through prayer and believing in each other and remembering what God has called us to do. Their passion to be God's hand, to embrace the hurting hearts often hidden in the bush of Alaska. They are Alaska missionaries. All right, here we go. Convoy hitting the road. Over. Preparing for this particular camp every summer is one of the most difficult things logistically, emotionally, financially, physically, in every way. So you throw this wrench in the works. Oh, um, your wife has breast cancer and is going to go through major surgery. So we decided not to cancel Camp Nashi. We knew Camp Nashi had to continue. It is very emotional, but just seeing you go through it so victoriously. And no matter what kind of crap we go through in life, there's somebody who's going through more. Yeah.